All right, so we're gonna watch this video. Monk gameplay, no commentary from Gamescom. And I am gonna play Monk, right? I'm only gonna play Monk. And I really kind of have uh, some kind of plan. It's not like, it's very abstract, right? Because obviously I haven't played the game yet or anything. So the way I was going to do things is that I'm going to obviously going to get a palm move, right? So the palm move, all the palm moves had dashes. So that's going to be my startup. So I'm going to start with a palm. And then um, I think there's like one monk skill where you do like three hit combo. So I'm going to do some kind of combo skill. And then I'm going to do a... And then they have also a jump back skill. And I'm also going to do a jump back skill. And then uh, after the jump back skill, there is a wind up wind move that slammed down. So uh, that's probably going to be like a combo finisher kind of thing. And yeah, I am going to be. Yeah, I'm going to be Monkey King. That's, that's, that's the game plan. <laughs> so let's watch this. This is from August. Glare of death like Luigi. I, I am for sure clicking WSD to move. Wait, the... So he picked a level 22 monk, right? The thing is, is it going to keep showing this? I'm, I'm pretty sure you can like turn off the tutorial or something, right? And like, it's always show like which movement type you want to start up in the beginning. I don't know. Yeah, so that slam move, I think that maybe not that one, but some kind of slam move is what I was going to go for. Yeah, see those three hit combo kind that's part of like a three hit combo thing. Or maybe maybe I'll do a flicker strike or something. Flicker strike seems cool. Where's my stick? My stick right there. Yo yo, watching this. <laughs> my staff. I don't know, green screen is probably in the way, but got got, got my staff. I'm ready. <laughs> Just want to make sure I don't hit the the screen, right? It's my weapon. In, in case like something happens at home. Ice crystals. So the nice thing about this, I guess I can keep playing it because then there's no there's no commentary, so I can just do the commentary, right? Tempest Fleury. Yeah, that, that's, this is, yeah. Okay, I don't know about the last hit, but. It's pretty fast. Is there another one that go like, ta, ta, ta. horizontally instead of vertically? You can, you can stop midway. Can he, can he like move the map? <laughs> in the way. Move the map to like to the left or the right. Okay, staggering palm. So I'm gonna take a palm move for sure. It's a dash too. Dashing enemy, so you need an enemy. Oh, unarmed doesn't get benefit from your wait wait. I just saw unarmed didn't get benefit from your weapon attack. Yeah, I don't get you don't no weapon damage. I mean, I guess uh, it's gonna be a startup move until we get like unarmed things, right? I heard there's no face breaker in the early access, or they need to work on like the unarmed animations for characters so they're not in there. Damn! Oh my. <laughs> So, I know there's gonna be like the Huntress or whatever with a spear, right? I feel like a quarter stack can also impale or like thrust. 
How come you can't thrust with a quarter staff? I feel like that's a thing. They have a thrust stand in freaking Black Label Kong. <laughs> This is level 22 too. Wait, how long is this? This is uh 36 minutes. So thanks for the prime sub. I don't know why I didn't know sound, but uh I'll do a burpee while I was looking at this. Oh no no no, we gotta pause this. What is this? Perpetual charge? Yeah, yeah, so you get a power charge, right? Okay, okay. Falling Thunder. Okay, that's what it, we're looking at. Oh, wait. Was, was he doing Tempest Fury and then into Falling Thunder? Are you doing Killing Palm now? I don't know, man. That That's cooling, right? When they're low HP? Yeah. Always gonna be performed unarmed, even if you have a quarter stat. Oh, he said something. It should say you're you don't know it, but you're already dead. <laughs> ice crystal dropping ice crystal seems cool. Okay, so that move is the falling thunder, and then after Tempest. Oh damn, you die. Ice, ice crystals. No mana. It needs some kind of impaling move, man. I swear. It does seem harder to play compared to like the mercenary video we watched earlier. But it seems way more fun, for sure. Falling Thunder. Damn, you're getting interrupted. So I'm guessing a monk probably want to run invasion or something like that, right? You should palm moves. <laughs> Not using any palms. Call them, they're dead. God, yeah, you know. <laughs> Finishing strike. Yeah, so that jump, doing a jump mat move like that will probably be like before I do like a combo finish. Mall. That one seems cool. With that, so I think that's that's I think that's falling thunder with power charges. Oh, now you use the unarmed strike. There you go. Get the power charge. What's a tree? Stuff like the miss threshold, three kills on death, and three HP on death with daggers. Oh, you can go dagger monk. <laughs> Power charges, siphon. Oh, I go a little too fast here, man. Yeah, okay, whatever. Recouple as life. Recouped as life. Sorry. I mean, Path of Exile 1, yeah, always like that. Tax speed? Gotta go tax speed, man. Chaos damage, yeah. So, if I'm going to the Chaos Monk route, I'm gonna take the Chaos damage. The staves. Unarmed? Yo, I, 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 should, I should totally get it. I gotta, I gotta make my way to the unarmed one. I can try to go on arm build, not gonna lie, and then just do palms all day. Getting power charges with palms and then uh, just palm everything. Keep bouncing back and forth and palming everything. And then do a finishing move. 
with a stick. Yo, what's up, man? I want the chaos damage. I want the Hannah Kukula. Elemental. Lightning. Chance to poison. What's the left side, man? You only show the right side. <laughs> Go to the left side, please. Okay, what else is here? Totems? Okay. Yeah, I, will, I won't be live at the launch, but I will be live for Girls Frontline uh, like 12 hours after it launches because I have work. So, And it's 4 a.m. for me. It's going to be 4 a.m. when the game drops. It's too early or too late, which I guess whichever. Ignite shock. Hmm. Yes. Bonus amulet applied to your minions. So that's what I was thinking. Like, what if I went minion monk build? I could totally do. Oh, we gotta get this one right. You can apply additional curse. But I don't know if you have uh, activation for curses. If you're automatically activating with the pump. Live regeneration and applied energy. Pain atonement. Fire resistance. It was all mana, life cause man. Okay, blood magic. So these are the farther nodes. They're mostly the same ish on in terms of uh, this other stuff, but then the inside stuff where near your character is more more regarding your class. Oh, wait, these grasshopper mantis grasshoppers. Uh, looking at this, I feel like I need a lot of AOE. There you go, do the unarmed strike. Pulling, no mana. Dude, that tornado, <laughs> that sandado, ancient seal. What wonders! So you got charges. You notice the orbs around. Oh. Act two. Traitor's passage. So the checkpoint, the waypoint look like that now. It looks like a pole instead of like a thing on the floor. They're low HP. Hit him with the pot killing palm. I want the that move. <laughs> that move sounds look way better though. 
But it depends if you have power charges. There you go. Falling thunder. But if you have good attack, you go out, pop, 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 <laughs> and then leave. Damn, it's a wind up time when the unarmed attack, you go like. The wind up time is kind of. Monk S. Yeah, uh, I'll I'll mostly be re-rolling it tomorrow. I won't do it at launch though, because it's 4 a.m. for me. But I'll do it after work. I'll be live after work. And I'll just re-roll. Probably re-roll it for the next uh, three days. While waiting for this game to drop. And then probably Infinite Nikki too. Infinity Nikki. Okay. Wing spear. Okay, sandwich. There you go. Yeah. yeah I get that. Summoner? Are you running witch? I think one build I would do as a monk is I want to go summoner monk. <laughs> I run chaos. Because I do a lot of curses and stuff. But. Whole vampire blade, vampiric blade. Gotta get those power charges, you know. I need a combo move that actually gives me a power charge. I'll see. I have to look at the moves again. It's snowing. Do you know you miss California where it doesn't snow? <laughs> you put those ice crystals and then it blows up the floor. Oh no, he's getting better. Yo, that that was smooth gameplay right there. Mobbing them all? Alright. Guy interrupted. Call it. No. There you go. And then power. Yep. Bad feeling. Yeah. Good food? You have bad food over there? Oh man. Okay, so it is Tempest Fury with the with the smack, I think, or is it the basic attack? I don't know. Maybe it's the basic attack. Totally hate that NATO. <laughs> yeah, see, I was thinking of like doing a palm strike to go in and then jump back out. Like either some kind of move to jump back, like doing the frost wave or put an ice crystal or something like that. They'll build up some combo and then uh, finish out for the combo finisher. These roly polies, man. Level 23. Like he just paused it and the monster right next to you. Oh, maybe it was dead. I don't know. <laughs> Wait, I didn't hit. <laughs> I 
Was it the hand thing there? What does that mean? Skill 4? I don't know about skill 4. But I do plan to go... I do... Well, right now the poll says I'm going... Uh, kind of a hula, yeah. I put a poll on Twitter. So far, uh, Chaos Monk is winning. <laughs> so I'm most likely probably going Chaos Monk at the moment. Unless, unless the poll changes. Over the next 24 hours. You too? Nice. I was thinking if I wanted to go uh, Curse Monk or just go Pure Chaos of some sort, but we'll see. Wait, that was, what was that fast move? Was that the Tempest Fury? Flurry? That one seems good. How come the, the quality seemed like for the video went down? <laughs> Fried chicken BBQ? No pizza? Oh, you activate the seal and then... Okay. I see. Oh, I didn't even... I didn't even see the quest list on the side. I'm not supposed to be here. Oh, no. They do have regular waypoints. They have checkpoint and waypoints. <laughs> yeah, I... So no matter what's gonna happen, I'll start off with one monk and then uh, once I get to like end game and stuff like that, I'll switch to another monk and I'll work on another monk. Whoa, range? Just mobbing him? Okay. Ooh, ran right into the, the kamikaze. You don't have power charges, man. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many projectiles. I have to look into which which AoE skill I want to use. Like falling thunder seems cool, but you need like a power charge to make it like OP. We need a way to get power charges. Is he moving with the mouse now instead of moving with the WASD? Oh, he's moving with the mouse now. Energy shield build? I, so I was thinking if I want to go Glacial Cassade or some kind of... So my plan is getting a palm move, right? I want to go, I want to go unarmed, right? But that's a startup. I want to do... I want a combo move and then... I know I need a palm move and then we need a startup move. I mean a combo move. So maybe like Tempest Fury or something that multi-hits. And then I need a jumping back move, which is either Crash of Crusade or like the Ice Crystal thing or something like that. And then I need a finisher, which I might most likely would use the win one. The charge up win move that I seen being used in the gameplay trailers. Where you like you wind up and you swing back and you just go BAM! So that's what I was planning to go with, but we'll see how things go. But then it kind of also depends maybe what unique I get. I don't know what uniques are going to be near. Maybe they have a Monkey King unique and then I'll build around that. <laughs> I'm hoping they have a Monkey King staff. If, th if there's a Monkey King staff in this game, I am totally going that build, whatever that build is. But it might not be in here. It may be like a future thing. For free, um, the director say six, six months to a year at most. I, I still think it's worth thirty dollars though if you were to buy a regular game. Just from all the content I'm hearing that's gonna be in this game. Yeah. Ooh ooh, that's a lot of damage. Webbed. I'm also thinking if I want to go a build where I just run all fist moves. 
<laughs> I just have I just have like four palm moves and I have one finisher. That's what I was thinking of also running. And I'll just keep dashing in between mobs and just punching them. And then I'll just get the unarmed stuff. But I don't think there's gonna be a lot of unarmed support at early access at the start. So I don't know. I'll see how things go. It could be fun to play with though and just go full unarmed. Because I saw in the tree of this video where there's uh, unarmed, 30% unarmed damage, and I totally want to get it. <laughs> oh damn, you're rolling into the dungeon? I think you should go kill the bass first. <laughs> there you go. Could have just rolled through them, but okay. Dude, these bats look so annoying. <laughs> Goliath. Is, I wonder if there's a way to increase the casting speed. I guess there probably is. For the unarmed attack. It doesn't look like this is a wind-up time. It takes a while. God. Now what's the why is it light up yellow? Dude, those things are even annoying too. These little small bulbs. Oh my god. No more, no more uh, life blast. Yo, use your palm moves. I'm almost dead. All right, there you go. Got one. Got a free charge. Oh, dagger. The nice thing about the game is that you can trade with anyone, right? So there's no restriction to trading. Yeah, right? I, I was planning to use the palm strike to start up my move. So my startup move for my monk is gonna be some kind of palm. I don't know what palm yet I'm gonna go with, but we'll see. I'll be hand of Chikula. Where you apply curse and then apply curses on the boss. <laughs> But in the beginning, obviously, you're not going to have it, right? So either Shattering Palm or... I don't... I'm not a fan of Killing Palm because it's very situational. But it also depends on what kind of move I want to use that I'm going to use charges. And if there's other things that give me charges, right? I could probably use those moves instead and then get that node that changes from one charge type to a different charge type. So depending on what it is, I can probably play around with that and see which one I want to go with. Kind of up in the air. Yo, Mario Fireballs, man. With that laser. Oh, rocks falling down. Squishy boss. <laughs> the freaking Colossus. Oh, I was like, you shouldn't stand there. Oh, there you go. One more. Okay, I think so that laser beam pretty much only hits up. Who knows? He might change his move mid mid fight. <laughs> Who knows? 
Oh, fissures. One more. Okay, that's three stabs. Is he moving the mouse? Yo, the bullet hell. Now, how do we know where, where the spike's gonna fall, man? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, damn, one shot. <laughs> Gushy Monk. And it's nice, right? It resets the boss. You have to start from the meeting. So you can't just cheese it. Oh my god, one shot again. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I just did what the boss did on my on my desk. Nice dodge, nice dodge. So he does a sweep and then a slash. Damn, he's slamming more off. Oh, watch out! Three stabs. So at that point, you probably want Glacial Cassade, right? So you can just jump in and just bounce back. Or he could have just palmed. Just, yeah, use the palm move to dash forward and then just jump back with the ice crystal thing. Oh man, it breaks the stage. I just noticed that. Yeah. So you gotta notice that he's uh, left-handed. The boss is left-handed. No, right-handed. My bad. Right-handed, so then uh, you got to be sure. Just look at the hand. See what he's moving. Left-handed means he's gonna slam. Right-handed is gonna stab you. Yeah. One more. Slam. Boom. A oh, fissure. So the don't the thing is I don't want to use killing palm because it's so situational, right? And right now you're fighting a boss, it's useless. It's it, I mean it's not useless, but it's like you can punch it, use it the dash move, but you don't get power charges now anymore. So I'm thinking of probably using a different palm or some kind of other move to get charges, so you can use bigger falling thunders or whatever skill you wanted to use. See, that's the that's the weaker power version of uh, the Falling Thunder. Oh look, mobs! Never mind, there's mobs here at least. They, they come, they barely come out, and he didn't palm them. <laughs> oh, he does use the laser now. I knew it. Okay, he does use the laser. Uh, second half of the fight. That one's going up though. Is there a cooldown? There's no cooldown to palm, huh? Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, hide behind the sword. Hide behind the sword. Okay. Why would he put his sword down? If I was the boss, I wouldn't have put my sword down. I would just fire my laser like that and hold the sword. <laughs> what the hell? I know it's the game thing, but... He's something to block, right? Palm him. Palm him. Palm him. Oh, there's no cooldown on Palm. It's just a wind-up time. So I can I can totally run Palm. Yo, I might do it. I might go all unarmed. <laughs> Except for the, the pole. And I'll just Palm everything. 
shattering palm and then go into the other thing. I just need more attack speed. Possible build I might go into. Possible. All right, good night. I think it may be better to do a palm and a jump back. Yeah. So the only thing that can mostly kill you is the sword stabbing you. And the laser. <laughs> also, that's what it means that melee is easier. You could totally dodge that. Keep hitting, keep hitting, what are you doing? <laughs> now you run, go. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Possible hand slam. Firing up. That's firing up. Yeah, I feel like falling thunder. Okay, so the gameplay style for Monk is to build up combo or build up charges in some way and then using your big move. Right? Using just falling thunder by itself isn't the best, isn't the optimal, right? He should use Tempest Fury, man. There you go. Come on, Tempest Fury. Tempest Fury. <laughs> there you go. I have a staff, and it's a lot faster swinging it like this. Right? I have a staff right here. Right? I have a staff right here, right? So it's faster swinging it like this. Instead of swinging it up down and then bringing it back down. <laughs> oh my god. Anyways. Yeah, so... Monk, Monk is all about comboing. It's not good to always just spam the same move as a monk. From the looks of it, when I'm watching the play, it was that. Okay. Oh, I like the I like the portal animation. <laughs> oh, and then <laughs> that's a pretty good portal animation. All right. I mean, it is what it is, right? It's it, for sure playing it and doing that in, in while you're playing is harder than me just watching and just observing, right? I'm I'm not fully con focused and concentrated. Uh, but yeah, so looking at the monk gameplay, I'm excited. The more I watch, the more I want to play, right? I just, I just, I just want to play more. And seeing how he played, I kind of know how I want to build my character. I need something with big AoE. Just, just one big AoE. Um, or like one big attack that can AoE. And then I got to use the palm strikes for mobility going in. And uh, of course, I will need a uh, using a back, uh, back, jumping back move. So those are the three things I would need, and then in between, I don't know. I'll figure it out as, as time goes. Yeah. Oh, okay.